Shalom, Kohaloyim La Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham Rachakwadash. Double honors unto our apostles and elders, a great millstone that rule well. Much peace and blessings to all you sense of Aki Mader, pushing this 100% truth with thought, sincerity, faith, and with charity. This is your brother Ash from Great Millstone, my enemy can't come back with another lesson through the spirit of power of Yahweh Bahasham Yahushai. And in this lesson, I want to, you know, just do a quick lesson. I'm in transit right now. It's just something I wanted to uh, speak on, okay? And, you know, just speaking on, you know, being spiritual, okay? And uh, as the scriptures say, we walk by faith, not by sight. And, you know, in particular, knowing that the Most High does not want everybody. The Most High is not looking to save everybody, which we notice, okay? Those of us that know this truth that, you know, you know, uh, actually know the doctrine have been reborn. We understand that the most high, as the scriptures say, uh, many are called, few are chosen. OK. And the many that are called is all Israel. That's because the, the, the word has went out through the four corners of the earth of all, all Israel is is being called to this truth. But we understand at the end of the day, the heavenly father is only going to save his elect he's only going to save his elect he's only going to deliver his elect nobody else okay the elect of the nation of israel the remnant okay so knowing that you got to also add the fact that not all of the elect are on the earth right now okay you guys uh well, we don't know how many but you're gonna have members of the elect that's in the spiritual realm right now okay but, you know, so the, the point is, is not to be carnal, you know, trying to look at the numbers. <laughs> All right. Because we don't know, we don't know who the most I got out there in the middle of nowhere watching videos that believe, you know, that could be preaching. You know, I, had, I remember a brother, you know, told me that he went to Tijuana and he seen a Jake out there preaching with no camera. So, you know, in Tijuana, that's real poor out there. They don't really have you know, technology access or internet access uh, readily available like uh, we have here in uh, Babylon, okay? So, who knows? So the point is to be spiritual and to understand that the Most High uh, doesn't want everybody. He's not looking for everybody. He's only looking for a small number. And you can't try to count, <laughs> okay? Don't try to count because you'll bug yourself out, all right? As uh, the scriptures say, you know, pray that the Most High send more uh, laborers into his harvest because uh, the harvest is plenteous, but the laborers are few. So we pray that the Most High raise up more laborers and we continue to labor. Okay, that's the name of the game. So let me just get into uh, a couple of scriptures and I'll close it out. This is 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 26. For you see your calling, brethren. Right? This calling, how we have been uh, called into this truth. This is our vocation. Okay? This is our profession. That word vocation means your calling. We, this is what we were put on this earth to do. This is the only reason we're alive. Alright? For you see your calling, brethren. How that not many wise men after the flesh... Not many mighty, not many noble are called. You see? So you're going to have a lot. You got a lot of Israelites out there that's very wise after the, you know, the manner of this world. Could uh, speak very well, very eloquent. You know, have a, a brilliant mind, so to speak. Okay? They, they may have a, a high seat in some type of organization or in the seat of the government or something they may have a pull within you know uh on the street they, they get they you know could get in touch with a lot of people they got a lot of connections whoop de whoop the, the most side knows to care about any of that okay you got uh a lot of uh jakes out there that's mighty real mighty you know been to the military went through different tours okay or uh, some jakes that's Look at, uh, you know, Floyd Mayweather, which Floyd Mayweather, he admitted that uh, that we're the Jews. 
So he he knows the truth, but he's not gonna. The most I ain't gonna uh, set up Floyd Mayweather to come out on the highways and the byways. Why? Because the scriptures tell you when a rich man speak, everybody hold his tongue. But when a poor man speak, they say, "Whose fellow is this?" All right. So the Most High, uh, as we keep reading, verse twenty-seven says, "But the Most High has chosen the foolish things of the world to confound the wise, and the Most High has chosen the weak things of the world." to confound the things that are mighty or which are mighty okay so the most is dealing with the lowly he's dealing with the with the poor of this world rich in faith okay and and, and that's gonna be a small number verse uh 28 it said and base things of the world and things which are despised have the most high chosen yet yeah, things which are not to bring the not bring to not things that are that no flesh of glory in his presence you see because we we where there's no room for boasting the most high chose us well he called us into this true lord willing we're chosen okay because of the fact that we're lowly because of the fact that we are uh you know, uh, not high up in this world. You see, a lot of brothers came in this truth, don't even know how to read like that. Okay? Don't even know how to really speak like that. Okay? But the Most High brought us up on a level to the point where we can uh, preach this word the way He wants it to be uh, preached. You see? So, yeah, you're gonna uh, you the, you know the, the point is it's not to be carnal looking around, you know, wanting the masses to get this truth. The masses is not gonna get this truth, point blank. Okay, so we gotta remember the scriptures. Remember, okay, that the Most High is only dealing with a small number. Okay, so he could get the glory. He's dealing. He he wants uh. Just like he did with the story of uh, Gideon and, and the men that were with him. Okay, he kept he kept finding different ways to trim down the numbers. So, you know, when when he uh raise just uh raises up uh you know you your brothers understand. If you see uh a, a three hundred men take out a hundred thousand men, you go you <laughs> that's some that's that's uh that's mighty. That's true might. Okay. And then, uh, of course, Lord, when we be those men, we're going to give all praises to you. How about Shemiah was shy? And he's going to get the glory. Okay. So, we, you know, go, it, it's, it's supposed to be the way it is. All right. Don't look at the, the view, your view count. Oh, you know, one view, two views. You've been going out on the streets week in and week out for years. Nobody listen. Nobody even, walk, you know, stop for a second. They just walk right by. Don't even inquire. Don't even, you know, ask. A lot of people don't even look at the sign. And a lot of, you know, to be honest, a lot of our people, they already know what this thing is about anyway. So we're getting close to the most side, you know, just uh, doing away uh, with this, you know, with this, uh, of us going out on the streets teaching and preaching that's that's not going to be forever okay the scriptures talk about the famine of the word okay and the scriptures say when this word is going out through the four corners of the earth then shall the end come so we 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 almost to that time not because of you seeing well we seeing more and more brothers you know and you know a few sisters coming in believing because the most high is going to uh, save women too but at the same time we looking at all these things that's going on in the world right now, the prophecies. That's how we know we're getting close. You see? And Lord willing, I'll close out with this. This is the book of uh, Ezekiel, chapter 11. All right? And 16. Therefore say, thus saith the Lord power, although I have cast them far off among the heathen, Talking about us in these last days, we're casted far off and throughout the four corners of the earth. 
and uh, you know especially here in the western hemisphere in babylon the great we're far off from our homeland you see and although i have scattered them among the countries yet will i be to them a little sanctuary in the countries where they shall come okay so this this thing of ours is a is a little sanctuary it's a small number it's not no it's not a, a huge huge uh mainstream thing even though this truth has become mainstream but the most is only dealing with with few so that's the way the most high program set up and that's just something you know quick i wanted to speak on something that we should just remember just to you know balance it out when you know different spirits try to get in your mind or you don't see you may not actually see the uh you know the masses or i ain't gonna say masses because you know the apostle bar went into that word masses it means death but the you're not seeing what's the word you're not seeing you you're not well you're trying to count 144,000 men you it's, it, you you you're not going to be able to do it you're going to bug yourself out so with that i hope it was edifying i want to give all praise honor and glory to yahweh by shem yahweh shai by shem rakhakodash double honors to our apostles and others a great millstone to the next lesson shalom